it first thing in the morning and post workout I have this thing where I uh, uh, make the special breakfast which I'll show you guys one day it's absolutely amazing it's everything you need uh, pre and post workout
kale salad. I'm gonna have that. Some hummus, some grilled chicken, and some rice. That's gonna be my post-workout meal for today. Here's tabbouleh, made with parsley, lemon, uh, tomatoes. Here's hummus, just an appetizer to start out with. We have some shish kebab, some meat shawarma here, shish stove, chicken, kafta, ground beef, and some rice. We'll start with that. I try to do seafood now like uh, three times a week because I do a lot of red meat quite a bit. And um, I've been eating uh, the first thing in the morning and post-workout, I have this thing where I uh, uh, make a special breakfast, which I'll show you guys one day. It's absolutely amazing. It's everything you need uh, pre and post-workout. It's a lot of egg whites, flaxseed in it, berries, uh, yogurt, um, cream of wheat, um, and some healthy uh, uh, plant-based butter. So I gotta show you guys that sometime. It's a real good uh, breakfast and it's good uh, post and uh, uh, pre and post work. Hope you guys enjoyed the last video um, of my Middle Eastern post-workout meal. 
and now I'm gonna have some seafood, some uh, uh, broiled uh, Atlantic cod, some pasta with some marinara, a salad, and some uh, steamed vegetables. Well, I'm gonna start with a salad here, good salad. It's always a good way to start out. What do we have to do tomorrow? Yeah. Um, I just got to work out and then um, I'll do some work around the house. And if you want to go shopping, go shopping and uh, we'll maybe go take them out to a park or something. It was a lot of fun the other day. I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed the water, it's really relaxing, it really is. Some broiled cod and pasta with marinara.